just want to say, uh, being around you two is wonderful. You both are incredibly kind, funny, and intelligent people. And when I hang out with y'all, it really makes me want to be a better person. I'm like, wow, I should be way nicer. Yeah. Like, you see how nice Collier and Taylor are? Why am I not like that yet? Oh. But, um, Collier, I've always looked up to you, even though I am astronomically taller than you. You've, you've always pushed me to do my best, try new things, and you've supported my endeavors throughout my whole life. Um, I, I could never ask for a better brother or friend. You, you are the man. And I love both of you, and regardless of what the future brings, one thing will remain the same, and that is happiness. such an important part of my family for so long now. I can't remember what it's like uh, to not have him. And I'm happy to know he'll continue to be a huge part of my life for years to come. Uh, uh, knowing someone for 18 years, you get to be there for a lot of moments in life. Uh, you get to be there for good moments, the bad moments, the funny moments, and the sad moments. But I feel so lucky to be able to say I was there for the best moment of Carl's life. And that is when he met Taylor. Uh, <laughs> uh, they hit it off at a party, not going to say which party it was, uh, <laughs> and if I remember correctly, that was the first time anyone got to see them dance, and everyone here got to see a little piece of that tonight, it was the spinning, and uh, <laughs> that's not, I've seen a lot worse, so it's truly a treat if you haven't been able to see it. Uh, Carl's an excellent dancer, and as you saw, Taylor, I love you. <laughs> but you're not the best dancer. <laughs> but, 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 what Taylor may lack in dancing abilities, she makes up for a guy being the kindest, sweetest person I have ever had ever uh, The kind of person I wish there was more of so that all of my friends could have their own Taylor. Um, the thing I love the most about Taylor is that she truly cares. And not just about Carl, but it's for his family, for his friends. I'm trying to have a close relationship with me. Uh, she is truly special, and I'm so thankful that Carl gets to marry her and spend the rest of her life. I am so fortunate to be able to call you both family and family in my life. Uh, I love you both more than I could ever say in one speech. And so I'd like everyone to please raise glass to the new bride and groom. To the rat clips. Cheers. You love me perfectly, and I will now get to spend the rest of my life showing you how much I cherish you. Thank you for teaching me, challenging me, and constantly making me better. You're everything that I never knew I wanted, and more. Oh boy. I feel so lucky to call you mine. I promise to protect your heart. I promise to love you and remain faithful to you. I promise to go into every new adventure with an open mind. And I promise to share my desserts with you. <laughs> I cannot promise not to steal all of your covers or not to take the last sips of your drink. But I promise to always laugh with you, lift you up when you're down, and 
and be your best friend. I love you with everything I am. I'll see you soon. Oh. I really wanted to wing these because that's just how I am. I planned on pulling out a blank piece of paper to pretend I was reading, but I knew how much these meant to you. So here I am writing these vows down. I guess in a nutshell, that's what I promise in our marriage. I promise to put our relationship before anything else. I want to always be learning and open-minded, to always be listening and not waiting to reply, to speak truthfully and work through these things together. There will be ups and downs, but most importantly, I promise to give the best version of myself forever.